Hello my beautiful, amazing, wonderful human beings. It's Cecilia, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to talk about how important it is to speak your truth, back yourself up, be there for yourself, stand up for yourself. Even if you are still learning to express your truth authentically and figuring out what works for you, whether it's speaking, art, singing, dancing, whatever expression of your truth looks like, it could be all of them, whatever it looks like, even if you're not quite ready to put it out into the world and public on the internet, you need to learn to get behind yourself internally. And you can start doing this now, even if you're not ready to express your truth. The most important thing in this life is that you get behind yourself. You get behind your own energy. You get behind your truth and are backing yourself up and are loving yourself and are cheering yourself on. Because if you are not cheering yourself on, that does not make for a very happy internal environment and it isn't going to get you very far at all. This is your life. This is your life. You have lived through things. You have experienced things that nobody else on this planet has. You are a beautiful, magnificent, unique culmination of all of these different things. It's never been experienced. It's never been created before. It's you. There is nobody else on this planet who is you, who can express as you. And so the first step to fully being yourself and stepping into your authenticity, which is what you were perfectly created, designed to be, is getting behind yourself and saying, yes, this is my truth and not worrying about what other people think. And this isn't saying like you need to go shouting it from the rooftops, do what feels right for you. But first, before you decide how you're going to share and speak your truth and live in your authenticity from a loving centered heart space, first you need to get behind yourself, get into that loving centered heart space. And you can't, if you're beating yourself up, if you're talking negatively to yourself, if you're living in the energies of shame and guilt and anger and not forgiving yourself, you need to get behind yourself first. You need to step into your truth. And you can do this right now. Do it with me right now. Put your hand on your heart if that feels right to you and say, hey, you have been through so much, it's all valid. You have been through so much, it's all valid. You've experienced so many things. And I'm here with you. I am here with you. I am here to support you. I'm here to love you. I trust you. You know what you're doing. You absolutely know what you're doing. You know you're on the right path. See how it feels talking to yourself like that and backing yourself up like that. That is what truly matters. We were all raised in the society that teaches us from the start to listen to authority, to listen to others, to play by the rules, to play it safe. We've been taught to dim our light and live in a box and fit into a mold. And you deserve to not live in that box. You deserve to break free of that and be who you truly came here to be. You deserve it. And in order to do that, you have to first get behind yourself and step into your truth. You are not crazy. Even if nobody can see your vision, 
You are not late for anything. You are not fucking it up. You are not undeserving. You are worthy. You know what you're doing. You are right on time. Your path is perfect. You have been through so many things and these can turn into your strengths if you get behind yourself fully. If you decide yes and say yes to yourself, yes, this is what I've been through. Yes, this is who I am. Yes, this is where I'm going. This is what I'm doing. But first, you need to get behind yourself. So it's time that you live in your truth. What is that truth? What is it to you? And this isn't to say if somebody's wronged you or, you know, society's wronged you. You don't have to go out and attack. This is coming together within yourself, coming into that centered space, that space of higher awareness and being the bigger person and being there for yourself and acting from that centered, loving space, acting that way towards yourself and expressing yourself fully and truthfully no matter what it looks like, no matter who you know is judging you, <laughs> no matter what, being there and showing up for yourself because whose life is this? You get to decide. You have the power in you. You have your own keys to your own happiness within you. You know who you are at your core. You know what your truth is. And you get to decide to live it. I love you guys so much. You're doing amazing. It's rough out here on planet Earth sometimes. <laughs> but we're fucking killing it. We are killing it. I personally have felt the shift into the new Earth. It's happened. We're here. It's just cleaning itself up right now. And the first step to that is getting behind yourself fully. So love you guys. See you guys next time. Bye.